I Will Keep My Soul is an exhibition that grew out of a residency in New Orleans. It was a residency that invited me to work with an archive, the Armistad Archive, which is the oldest African-American archive in the, in the States. As well as that, to try and embed myself a little bit and, and meet as many people as I could in different ways um, in New Orleans. The project, I guess, is kind of a rhizomatic project. It has tentacles and roots. Uh, it kind of expands like a web. Um, and in that way, it, it really um, is a representation of my experience in New Orleans. It's a project that tries to think about the connections across time and across place. It's thinking about and asking questions about a kind of diasporic black experience, which is, I suppose, particularly because it's New Orleans, is embedded in art and music. And it's thinking about the relationship between art, music, politics, activism, uh, and what can happen um, when those things connect with each other. I would really hope that audiences take away something. And I know that might sound a strange thing to say, um, or a reductive thing to say, but actually, I don't want people to take away something specific that I control. I want them to take away something that's about thinking and it's about feeling. Those are the two things that are really important to me, is the bringing together of thought and feeling, because um, for me, they're the ways that change really happens, whether that's personal intellectual change, whether it's emotional change, is those two things have to sometimes, they have to collide or they have to connect in some way. And so that's what I hope people will take away.